A Proctor Profold entrance gate can usually be installed in less than a day because, as you can see, it comes largely assembled on one of our trucks ready to be lifted into position on pre-installed bases. Being fully organised and prepared on site makes this quick installation possible, with all our experienced and skilled installation team knowing the exact part they have to play in a quick, efficient and safe installation. The folding gates, or speed gates as they're also called, being installed here are from our Pro Fold range. As the first gate comes off the lorry, you can see just how complete it is, and with the bases in exactly the right position to match the gate's fixing points. Depending on the size of the entrance, just one folding gate may be required, but here two gates were used because of the wide entrance required for large delivery trucks and other vehicles. Now the pre-installed electrics can be connected up with various other small tasks following. Just four hours into the installation and the gates make their first test opening. Testing continues to ensure the gates are fully operational and the all important safety features work correctly. And by three o'clock, just seven hours after the gates arrived on site, they are installed, commissioned and fully working ready to be handed over to the customer. Here you can see just how smoothly the gates operate with this flashing safety light always on when the gates are opening or closing. One of the things we do for many customers is add their logo to the gates, with the colour of the gate being something we can match to virtually any standard or special colour. With this view of the gates in operation, the way bifolding gates work becomes clearer, with the obvious advantage being firstly that the gate leaves take up less space when open compared to a conventional swing gate and secondly the speed which they can open and close compared to all other types of gate, including sliding gates. All Proctor folding gates are fully compliant with current health and safety requirements. If a person, vehicle or any obstruction enters the gate operating zone and activates the high or low level safety light beams, the gate will immediately stop and then reverse to the open position. The second safety device, which stops the gate in the event that anyone or anything comes into contact with it, is called a safe edge. This is a simple switch device which runs vertically up the side of the gate edges and posts. We hope you found this video useful and informative.